Hey guys, what's up? It's Young Prepper. I'm back for part two of the seed stockpile. So we're going to start back up right where we left off since uh, I ran out of time on my phone. And so let's get back to it. We just got a few more to go through and we'll be done. So um, the next up is uh, Golden Bantam. Uh, this is corn. There's 100 seeds. It's not a lot, but uh, you figure you probably get about 200 seeds per plant. If you save the seeds at an 85% germination rate, so whatever 85 times 200 is, uh, we got American Flag Leaks, 100 seeds of that. Uh, we have 1,000 Snowball Cauliflower Seeds. Again, these all have 85% or higher germination rates. These are Marglobe Tomatoes. We got 100 seeds there. Uh, Marigold Cracker Jack Mix. Uh, that was also a bonus. There is a lot of bonuses in here. Uh, we got Roma Tomato. There's 100 seeds in there. Tomato, tomato, or tomato, tomato, whatever. Uh, tomato, uh, these are homestead tomato seeds. There's 100 in there. We got uh, yellow brandy wine tomato, 100 seeds. Um, we got small red cherry tomatoes, 100 seeds. We've got uh, bonus long red cayenne pepper seeds. There's er, 30 in there. Um, we got beef steak tomato, 1,000 seeds. Uh, guys, again, all this stuff will plant five to eight acres, and when you figure one tenth of an acre, we'll give you two to three times what a family of four needs for a year. So you're pretty well set with this. Uh, blue corn flour, there's 30 seeds in there. Uh, guys, again, like with the tiger melons, I don't even know what the hell a blue corn flour is. Um, if you got or the uh, marigold cracker jack mix, if you guys could leave a comment and um, tell me what they are. Um, if I could use them for cooking, um, do they repel anything? Are they poisonous? Um, these are bonus jalapeno peppers. There's 30 seeds in there, and we're all out in our little pile. Some more. Now, now we're getting into the big pile. Now we're getting into the good stuff. Yeah, the goodies. Okay, so um, this one is chia seeds. This is the Saba Hispania, 10 grams. Hispanica, my bad. Um, uh, if you look on the page that this stuff's on on eBay, the, or the seed stuff I'm talking about, uh, it lists a lot of the health benefits of chia, and this is for growing. Because there's only 10 grams in here, you might as well, uh, you'd be better off growing it and saving seed from it instead of just eating it. But if you really had to, you could just eat it, but then you'd only get the short-term health benefits for it compared to growing it, saving seeds, and getting the long-term benefits. So we got uh, uh, crimson giant radishes. There's 10,000 seeds in there. Uh, just a little one down here. This is a little tiny guy. This, uh, this is uh, zucchini green squash, 100 seeds. Good stuff. Oh, uh, this is winter giant organic spinach. One thousand seed or oh, that's not one thousand. That's ten thousand. Made a big boo boo. But um, guys, all this stuff is um, all organic, um, non-GMO heirloom seeds. Uh, next up is dwarf sugar peas. One thousand seeds. Nice big bag of those. Uh, to give you a size comparison of this stuff, here's a juice pouch on that. I uh, just happen to have that juice pouch on there. Oh, let's get more. Oh, come out. Okay, so next up is we got 35,000 oat seeds. Oats are very important. They are a superfood. I highly recommend getting some of these. Uh, you can also use them for animal feed after you grow them. And then you guys were thinking earlier, not much corn, only 100 seeds. This is yellow favorite corn. There's 1,000 seeds here. I believe this is uh, dent corn. 
because I know the band comes with sweet corn. If this is a sweet corn, I'm going to um, get some uh, yellow trucker's favorite or trucker's delight, whatever it is. Because I know that's a dent corn, I, and I can use that for chicken feet. Put through a, you put it through a Corona-style grinder. Um, we got provider bush beans. There's 1,000 seeds in here. Again, uh, this is a pretty big sack. Um, or, hope I didn't. Oh, well, never mind. Uh, these are Mexican pinto bush beans. Uh, like if you want to make chili or something, stuff's good for it. Again, 1,000 of those. All this big stuff's pretty much 1,000. And last but not least, we got probably one of my favorites besides the corn. We have red kidney beans, 1,000 seeds. Look at that, look at that, 1,000, 1,000, 1,000, 1,000. Okay, so, guys, there is the wall of seeds. Over a quarter million plus seeds, we'll plant five to eight acres in here. Um, uh, pretty small box. I think this is one of the smallest priority mail flat rate boxes. Um, let me turn it like this. Again, juice pouch. This is one of the mint made cooler things. And that's just the box size right there. So, it's a pretty small box. There's like eight pounds of seeds. Uh, quite a bit of stuff. I think you guys should check it out. Think of buying one. Great price. Um, yeah. This is the end of part two, and I will see you guys later. Well, um, actually, the next video we're going to do is um, about fruit trees, and the next one after that is fruit bushes. And then um, we're going to be covering a bug out vehicle, and... Uh, sometime this weekend we're going to go out and I'm going to do some jig fishing on the local Puyallup River. But, um, actually it's not even fishing season. But, um, uh, I'm just going to test out the pen rod. And, I, well, I'll be jig fishing with the pen rod. But, um, I'm going to test that out. I'm going to show you guys the soil filter in action. And so, um... Comment, rate, subscribe, uh, give me links to your videos, guys. Um, keep in touch. Young Preppers out. Later.